Ah, it wasn't even plugged in. It's not even plugged in. We have some amazing sunsets here in Fujera. The, um, the dust in the sky is just a kind of catalyst for this burning hot, like, ball of red that happens. It's just... It's just incredible. Um, obviously not good for breathing, I guess, all the dust and all the sand in the air, but uh, yeah, the sunset's pretty good. So, um, I've been uh, trying to make a video for a little while now and it's just not been working. I haven't had a single minute of free time to do anything. Um, work has just been crazy. Working as a, as a teacher and also as a kind of getting this data story ready for, the, uh, for our school. Um, it's been mental, yeah. We've got an inspection, a review coming up on... You can hear these cars like at night, about two or three o'clock in the morning. Motorbikes and quad bikes, they just pelt up the, um, up the road here and it's just, oh, I tell you, the worst thing in the world. It's just the most annoying. It seems to be every night now. It's just not, not, not nice. We have an inspection. Uh, coming up now, not tomorrow, the next day, uh, a kind of internal review from other from other gem schools who are coming to kind of assess our performance and see where we're at and to give us advice on where we need to improve. Uh, I'm looking forward to it, it should be really good. Lots of things to get ready for it, um, but overall I'm just going to continue doing what I normally do and see uh, what happens. Got my results back from the module one of the Talal leadership course. Um, I think I did quite well. Got a got a distinction in one of the assessments and like a few marks off a distinction for the other ones but the feedback I received was just really good. It pointed me in the right direction for the next module now and I've got loads of kind of um, guidance of where where to improve the next uh, assignments. Lots of people have been talking about um, can I work in the UAE as a teacher if I'm not if I have, if I've got this, if I've got that. Generally speaking, the UAE has always been a place where you can teach, um, providing providing you have the skills that, that you need to teach and you have the knowledge, the subject knowledge. Um, however, as of recently, the UAE is bringing in teacher licensing laws, I guess, where teachers do need to be licensed and registered and trained um, just to kind of raise the quality of teaching in the country, I guess. And it's happening with leadership as well, with head teachers. They have these head, new head teacher regulations and license, licensing laws. So it's just, I think, I think the UAE is trying to, it is raising its game. The Ministry of Education is trying to, trying to build, you know, slowly but surely, build up the layers to improve the education system. There's a, there's a kind of unwritten phrase where people say, you know, Dubai is 10 years behind the UK in terms of the progress that the children make and, and the, the systems that are in place. Fujera is like another 10 years behind that, it seems. We, um, we're working on a completely different system almost. We've got uh, no half terms, so we just go straight through like a 13, 14, even 15 week term. Um, which drives the kids mental um, and it also drives the teachers a bit crazy because there's no time to, 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 to catch up and to prepare for the next term or the next topic. Um, but overall, I mean, we're getting there, we're, we're doing what we can, we're, uh, we're, we're, we're teaching these kids as, as, well, as best we can. Um, my battery is going to die now, so I better go. Um, it's been a bit of a short video, but uh, yeah, I'll try and make an exciting one next time. Uh, thank you for watching and leave any questions in the comments below as you have been doing. I will get to all of them and start answering the questions. Also, you can follow me on Twitter, Mr. A Short. Uh, I post loads of videos and um, kind of photos and tips about the teaching and learning that we're doing here in Fujera. So um, yeah, thank you guys. See you later.